Hello, and welcome to the People's Mental Stimulus Update. This is an additional. I gotta say this, I am sorry for all you Texas people out there that are on, on unemployment because, well, your governor has done something that you're not. You might have heard about it by now, but if you haven't, then you might want to stay tuned because I took a little clip off of uh, the social media platform I use that explains exactly what Governor Abbott has actually done for his constituents. So if you Texas people are there still Republicans to think that Republicans stand for the people, your governor's actions will actually be a bit different than that. So without my you just go right to the clip right here for you, so right back. One second. All right, it's begun. Greg Abbott has canceled federal unemployment assistance for Texans. So if you were getting an extra $300 a week on the pandemic unemployment insurance, that's gone now. He said the Texas economy is booming and employers are hiring in communities throughout the state. He made some claim that 45% of jobs that are open are paying $15.50 per hour or more. Basically, he's saying there's jobs, go get them. But it's not that easy, Greg. Those jobs may not be available in everybody's areas. Those individuals may have kids at home and they don't have access to affordable childcare. Some people may have also contracted COVID and are still dealing with the lingering effects. There are also people that are dealing with agoraphobia and PTSD now because they've been quarantined for over 14 months. Or maybe you just lied about how many jobs are paying a fair wage. The real question is, why did he do this? Well, that's a super easy question to answer. Business lobbyists told him to. He's serving his masters here. Profit over people, right? And as you saw, Governor Abbott, he cut off the extended unemployment for people of Texas. That's right. So if you're getting $600 with a $300 bonus on, on that, so basically 300 bucks plus 300 for the bonus, well, now you need to be getting cut in half back down to $300. What was you getting for the $300? So, is it a good time to be Republican? I don't think it is. A lot of shit, a lot of bad shit is going down with the Republicans right now, and I don't know what to say about that. But hopefully it gets better. I'm not sure if it will until the nine good Republicans that wanted to impeach Trump actually decide to boot the bad Republicans out and who's mixed the snitch McConnell and Ted's fools and, you know, all the other crap. All the other losers out there. But, hey, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Until next time, you guys have a great evening.